Megan's mom. Welcome to our boob vlog. Fourth year. Woo -woo. Hey, what's up you guys? Megan here. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today marks the first day of my college move-in vlog. For those of you who don't know me, I'm a rising fourth year at the University of Virginia. I am moving in to my apartment today. I'm starting at least. I'll kind of explain a little bit more once I get to my house in Charlottesville. My mom's gonna drop me off at my sorority house that I lived in this past year where all my stuff is, or most of my stuff is. And I'm gonna finish up work for the day. I have work until about three. Then after, I'll kind of start doing the move-in process. I'm really excited, I'm gonna show you guys a little empty apartment tour, kind of give you my thoughts on like how I'm going to organize everything and like decorate and all that. And by the time this is going up, my apartment hall should already be up. So definitely go check that out if you wanna go see some of the decor I bought for my apartment or it's like where I got a bunch of stuff on a budget. So if you guys are new, definitely subscribe down below and let's get into the moving vlog. All right, everyone, we have made it to the apartment. We're trying to size it up. Obviously, Pam's here. I'm here, it's very cute. It's cute. I can see your car. Yeah. Very nice, got the car over there. It's obviously very open in here, which is nice. And then this is our kitchen, and I love the blue. It's very like nice, new, renovated. I have a ton of storage over here where we can put like pantry stuff and fridge is super nice as well. And we have a closet over here, actually. Oh, I have a closet here. Okay, that's convenient. And then you walk in, and then Liv and I are sharing this bathroom right here. It has kind of like the same materials as the kitchen. Pretty normal size bathroom, I feel like. A little medicine cabinet action. I think we're definitely gonna do some kind of like floating shelf storage here, just because we need a lot of storage. We need like, obviously like shower curtains, stuff like that. And then there's space back here. And then if you walk to the right, this is my room here. Definitely a little bit smaller than I was remembering but I do have these nice east facing windows. I'm thinking at the moment I'm gonna do desk here, bed up against the wall, which originally I was gonna center it, but I think up against the wall will probably be better. And then dresser here, unsure though. I might do dresser over here. I feel like desk over here might be a lot when you walk in. We can kind of play with it. But then back here, I just have my closet, which I actually really like this like alternating thing. Just because I don't have a ton of hanging clothes, so I feel like I can put like stuff in the bottom here and like storage and stuff. And then I like that these shelves are here for storage because I feel like I can definitely source some stuff up there. All right, guys, we moved just a few things in. We have this little thing. This was in my bathroom last year, if you all remember. And this was actually in Liv's apartment this year. And I tried to put it in between the toilet, but it didn't fit. So it actually fits super perfectly here. And you can just like leave the door open as normal and house a bunch of stuff in there. So that's really convenient. I'm thinking. I'm gonna get one of those like shower hanging organizer things. TBD, I don't know. And then I just have a bunch of like random decor stuff. This blanket was just to like house everything. I just have my bedding, these pin boards, my backpack I'm actually taking with me, and then my nightstand. Not much at all, but just some like random stuff that I could carry in today. I didn't show you guys, but I actually packed up all my stuff at Kayo, so that's like ready to go for tomorrow. I don't know how much we're gonna move today just because it's been like a pretty long day, even though I feel like I haven't even done anything. Honestly, the lighting in here is pretty good, even though it looks pretty blue, it's about to storm. But I don't know how much more we're gonna do today just because it's kind of been a long day. We're definitely like ready for tomorrow and ready to move everything in. I'm excited to like organize everything and see how it works out. But yeah, that's the update. Good morning, everyone. Today is Saturday. It is the official move-in day. And I just wanted to give a little bit of background of what I'm doing because you guys are probably watching. If you've seen any of my old move-in, move-out vlogs, you're probably like, what is she doing? My time at Kayo ends June 15th, which is a few days from now. My lease for my new apartment started on June 1st. So I had to move obviously all my stuff from Kayo to my apartment, my new apartment in Charlottesville. I was originally going to stay the summer in Charlottesville, but I'm thinking now I'm probably just going to stay the summer in Richmond just because it's so much cheaper and I have free access here to our Peloton. We basically have like this full home gym and it's just obviously like food is free here too and considering how much money I spent this semester, probably for the best. I'm definitely still going to come up to Charlottesville on some weekends and see my friends and I just think that it'll be 
a lot easier for me to travel this summer and spend money if I'm not spending all my money in Charlottesville. So basically today I'm taking all of the stuff that I've either ordered for my apartment or I just have here that I have from last year and bringing it to the house, to the house, to the apartment, sorry. I'm taking everything from Kyle, moving it into the apartment. So everything's getting moved today except for the couch and some other really big furniture pieces like rugs and stuff. Around mid-July, whenever the couch is ready, it's LT's grandma's couch that we're getting. We're getting that whenever her new couch is ready or they have the new couch. So that's going to be more mid-July and that's when I'm going to get the U-Haul and do that whole bit. But I wanted to get as much furniture there as possible today and this weekend while the lease has started. Also, the reason I'm going to Charlottesville to move in today instead of last week, I'm going to start driving guys. Sorry, I'm picking up Starbucks. It was honestly more for like logistics things. And also today is Mary's 21st birthday party. So exciting. All of my friends are going to be there. It's going to be so much fun. I'm super excited for that tonight. So that gives me some motivation to be done. This is obviously like definitely a move-in vlog, but it's not like, I would say this is like part one of two. I'll probably film a little bit and just integrate that into a vlog whenever I move all of my like U-Haul stuff into my apartment, like the couch and stuff like that. And I'm sure I'll be back there this summer. So I'm sure you guys will get like some Charlottesville vlogs. The main move in besides this one will be in August whenever I move all my stuff to Charlottesville. So hope that clears a little bit of things up. If anyone cares enough to ask a question, feel free. I'll definitely answer it. It's a little confusing, but I feel like it's a really great problem to have since I only live an hour away. I kind of just do whatever, which is really awesome I can be super flexible but I know for my friends who are farther away or out of state they definitely don't have this flexibility so they kind of are either in Charlottesville or not this summer I'm glad that I can kind of do everything see everyone and still have a really great summer save some money that was kind of like a long-winded uh, explanation but I'm gonna grab my coffee gonna go to Starbucks and then we are gonna head to Charlottesville Got our helper here today. This is way too much stuff. Oh, thank you, Connor. Way too much. Hey guys, I'll say it. It's a little stuffed in here. This is my front seat next to me, like in comparison, so good. Yeah, getting ready to go. Clearly my father was the last one in here because I like, Mm, that feels wrong. I have like no room to move. We're off to Charlottesville. Let me say it one more time. Like, God, I guess we freaking get it. Do I go to EVA or something? Here's all the stuff I have to bring in my car. Good Lord, guys. I'm gonna leave my bedding here. Well, not leave, leave, but like for the night. And then all my clothes are packed up too. All these are empty. Still have drawers underneath there, but they're packed. <sighs> Out of breath. Also these new shorts, so cute, love the color. Hey guys, my face is so red right now because it is so hot outside and there's, you can probably hear the AC but I couldn't do it with no AC. It's currently 2.19, we got here about two hours ago. I've pretty much moved everything out of Kayo. I still have like my food stuff and like my Keurig and then some like random things I couldn't fit in here or my dad's car. I probably could have but like I just didn't, it's a lot. So I'm gonna go to my apartment and drop all this stuff off, unload it all. I'm literally so out of breath, I'm so tired. I don't know, I feel like sometimes these moving vlogs First of all, I like get really stressed out So that's why I like haven't taken a bunch of clips today Which also stresses me out But also I feel like people neglect to mention Just how stressful moving can be And definitely feeling that right now And honestly it doesn't need to be stressful I'm just making it stressful So I just need to take a deep breath It'll all be okay I might go get a snack somewhere I'm not sure where But kind of hangry Maybe that will solve my problems And then go to my apartment Take a deep breath Figure it all out It'll all be okay. I think I'm also stressed because I have to look cute tonight, but I have the goal to be all done at five, whether or not I'm actually done. It doesn't really matter. I just need to sleep somewhere tonight so that I can get ready and have fun with my friends, but it'll all be all right. Furniture. I want to thank everyone involved, Ikea, my family, and just 
had a great career putting it together, but I think it's time to say goodbye. <laughs> update um to be honest <laughs> nothing too much my dresser is built which is amazing it's back there and i'm currently getting ready for the night for our party for mary's birthday and actually one of her friends who's also a mutual friend of mine and then jack who's also a friend of mine it's also their birthdays their birthday parties so it's gonna be a super fun joint birthday party currently in the kitchen but i have a ton of stuff down here and as you guys saw in the clips it's just kind of a mess in my room. I'm not sleeping here tonight, thankfully, and I have my box spring set up there, but I'm just gonna have to do everything else tomorrow. And that's kind of gonna be where the fun little montages are. Today was literally just transferring stuff from the cars to Coyote, Coyote to the cars, to the apartment, to everything. Those were honestly pretty hard to get time lapses of, so. I'm gonna catch you guys tomorrow. Maybe I'll get a couple clips tonight. I'm trying to figure out a way to show you guys my outfit. I don't have a full length mirror. Maybe I'll just like step back here and aim it down. That's what I'm wearing tonight, I think. I'm bringing an outfit change to 1252 to see if I wanna do something different. I'm just gonna wear my little floral top. This one, hold on. This one from H&M. The straps, oh, the strap is falling down. It looks like this and it's just like super cute. But two things, I think it's a little too cutesy. It's a little too white. I'm like paler up top than I thought I was. I think this is more of a daytime vibe and I feel like this is more like nighttime. So I'm wearing this top from Finch. I feel like it's like a little like scoop, a little cute. And I'm doing my Forever 21 bracelets, class ring, obviously Apple Watch, like whatever. And then necklace is also from Finch. And then Spirit is my favorite from Forever 21. And then I'm wearing my brand new, new to me. Well, they are brand new actually. Boots from Target. And for makeup, I actually put on eyeshadow. Whoa. <laughs> I love the way it turned out. I also feel like this top, it's really weird lighting because sun setting, but I feel like this top really brings out my blue eyes. So I think it's really cute. And I think it's more nighttime vibes. So Good stuff. Gonna head over to 1252 pregame. We're going out. I'm so excited. packing up and of course I forgot my vlog camera so this is what y'all are getting. Chloe and her May. <laughs> no. <laughs> Wait oh my gosh okay should Chloe poll in the comments should Chloe start a YouTube channel? I say yes. Good great I'm glad you all think the same thing. I'll do it just my arm. Maybe if you'll follow me. Follow Chloe. Well there's no channel but follow my channel. <laughs> She'll link it below. It doesn't exist. <laughs> that don't have anything in them. Back. Like just like like, ooh, that type. five shells. <laughs> oh, this has absolutely nothing in it. Like, that's just maybe two chips are in there. Nothing's in here. Oh, yeah, don't even show them. I have potatoes in here from Chloe. I have a letter in here. From who? It's a check. Oh. I cashed it. Oh. the wall so easy it's sticking to my hair but these are restickities i talked about these in my move-in vlog these are great for dorm rooms or also like college apartments when you're moving a lot also i'm super decisive so i feel like these are just really great because you can always change them up on your wall i actually feature these in my move-in vlog i'm gonna link them down below for y'all and i actually have a promo code you can use the promo code down below to get yourself some restickities and these are so awesome i'm taking them down here but i'm going to be taking them to my new apartment this afternoon and i don't know where i'm gonna put them yet actually now that i think about it guys i don't know what it is about this move i am so sweaty it's not even that hot out i'm just sweating Probably sweating out all the alcohol from last night. Let's get honest. Hi vlog. 
I'm here with Sam, obviously. She's lost her voice, it's so yes. tragic. <laughs> so she has to do the talking for the both of us. As we saw yesterday, no progress. But we did bring all of my stuff from Kyo and finally moved out of there, thank the Lord. I'm literally so exhausted. I have all the stuff behind me and all the stuff in my room and Liv's room. So it's just, it's, it's a lot. It's currently 149. It's time to grind. We're gonna put on some big booty. And grind. We're gonna have some other friends come here later, and I don't think they know that they're volunteering themselves for this. Like, oh, get prepared. They better sign. They know. They know what they're signed up for. Anyways, we are going to put the bed together first. Box frame, headboard, bed frame, <laughs> sheets, bedding, everything. I bed feel skirt. like that bed skirt, <laughs> pillows. Like, I feel like that's gonna get a lot of volume out, yes. and that will also just like put my mind at ease. So, we're gonna do that. Get after. <laughs> progress I would say I think we're gonna move the rug a little bit to the left I don't know also I put the dresser over there I don't know we still need to locate the hardware for the headboard to get it up since the pillow situation right now I'm also debating whether or not I want to get another set of these pillows to do three and then put another pillow somewhere else I don't know I don't know but this is just like doing the most for me right now this is a lot and Sam and I are going to get food thank you finally oh we also got the table set up it kind of looks uh, it's a little wonky. it's a little something's going on I don't know I'll figure it out. yeah it's fine it's fine she's set up and I never have to unscrew these things again thank god but it's still we're still uh we're getting through it we're doing it Help. What are your questions? Where to put this? Music off so you can keep the audio on. Um, I know how to vlog. Right okay, now guys. we're struggling with where to put. Hi. Let's do a Q&A. So, <laughs> Q&A. Q if you could have a question with one person yeah, better alive, who would it be? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, why do you have this? <laughs> that, 
Hey guys, I just found a knife. Okay, I should go. <laughs> should really go. Alright everyone, we have secured the headboard. It definitely obviously needs some more pillows because she's looking a bit bare. Probably need to move them over a little bit. Secured is a little um, bit of a, you know, understatement or overstatement, whatever you want to call it. Questionable statement. Sam and I tried and uh, we will be trying again whenever my dad comes. So, But I'm loving the pink rug with the white just like ugh, vibes and I definitely obviously still need to steam it but oh and the shoe organizers fit perfectly underneath here so that's huge for the program this will probably be handled by the time you see this but poll did you like the dresser here or did you like it there like I feel like it was a lot when you walked in and this is really open, but I feel like this looks dorky. Especially since I'm gonna have a tall lamp on here and... Cool. Do you put your desk here and move your dresser right there? I have talked about this. I don't know. Lot to ponder. <laughs> Lot to ponder. Leave me a comment down below. What do you think I should do? Help, please. Help. Alright vlog, we have made the executive decision to put the dresser over here. I'm feeling good about this. I'll have to see obviously whenever I put my desk in, but I just feel like the room just feels so much more open. Pillows are looking a little sad right now. Currently just moved everything into my room, which I'm gonna unpack just a different day, guys. I can't do it today. It's been the longest three days. We have all my stuff that's going home with me. Some trash and Sam. Um, really over here. But we did roll out the rug. It looks great. It's absorbing some of our sound. We have my bottle of gin over there. Just everything feels right. <laughs> Just everything's to be organized a different day. I've literally only put down a bath mat in here and squatty potty, obviously. I'm proud of the work that we have done because this has been a lot of work. Welcome. Goodbye. Goodbye. See you never.